Hey guys, so consider this part two to my last video. Now, I talked about in the last video how our hearts are wicked because they're in the sin nature and we shouldn't trust it because it's deceitful and full of sin. Well, I have a solution. When you let Jesus into your heart, He changes it. He cleanses you of that sin. So, after you let Jesus into your heart, you can listen to your heart because your heart becomes Jesus' heart. And when you start to change, your desires change. You'll want to do only what Jesus wants you to do. You'll want to feel only what Jesus wants you to feel. Your emotions become Jesus' emotions. That's why I believe it says it's no longer you, but Christ that lives in you because you have been changed and brought out of the world and into God's presence. Now, I want to talk about some of the things that will change. If you have anger towards somebody and unforgiveness in your heart, that will be cleansed. If you have selfish desires, that will change too. Like, um, you know, if you just want to live for yourself and for the world, that will change because you'll want to live for Jesus in heaven only to win souls to heaven. Now you can still use your gift for the glory of Jesus, but you got to not make it about yourself. I want to encourage you guys to let Jesus in your heart. Jesus wants to give you so much more than what you want for yourself. Jesus is knocking at the door of your heart. He's just waiting for you to answer him. Are you going to answer or are you going to reject? You don't know how much time you have left. Please take this to heart. I promise you, if you let Jesus in your heart and let him change you and transform you, you won't regret it. Jesus' way is better than your own way. I've experienced it. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later. And by the way, this is to kind of bring this whole thing full circle. Now you can trust your heart because it's no longer deceitful. Jesus can never lie. So therefore, when Jesus is at the center of your heart, you can trust it because it's pure and holy.